was um, very particular about a lot of things, which I found interesting. Um, a lot of directors will let um, the you know, costume people and the hair people just do what they want to do with you. You know, they got their parameters, but he was very particular. He was, I got a note that said, oh no, Barry didn't like you in that shirt. We're going to put you in another shirt. And I'm like, okay. So he's really particular and uh, about how his vision was. So I guess that's why he's a great director because he's particular about how things were. But like I said, this was very secretive, so you don't get you didn't get your scripts. You were just sent your little pages. So none of us who were in the film knew really what was going on in the film. We didn't know what was going to happen in the middle, what was going to happen in the end. You would have to talk to other actors and say, what scenes are you in? What's happening in the scene that you're in? And that so that's very strange. You usually get to read the entire script before you show up on your first day. I felt especially uh, sad for Frank Deal, who plays the mayor in the film, because he actually did not get his you know, 32 pages of dialogue until the day before he came to Georgetown. So he had one evening to learn all his part before he showed up the next morning and had to you know, give this big speech that he was giving in, in the town. And um, I was a little bit luckier because I knew what my sides were from my audition, so I sort of, you know, paid attention and figured they were all, they probably weren't going to change it much, so I probably had that. Of course, it was three or four pages of dialogue I have, and I think I have two nuns. <laughs> so it's what they call, ended up was it on the editing room floor, which was pretty common. But what was also uh, strange about uh, the Bay is how it was filmed. You know, usually there's there's one camera in film. You know, I'm sure in the big major blockbusters they have more. But um, there's one camera. You know where your camera is. You know to play to your camera. It's like having, you know, in the theater with an audience, you play to the camera. But this had all the extras and everybody were filming with, they would hand them iPhones or they would hand them little camcorders. And so the people that were in the scene were actually filming the scene that you were in. So there could have been eight or nine cameras filming what you were doing <coughs> while you're doing your scene. You would come here to the theater and they would download every night. They would watch all the dailies, they're called, everything that went on just to make sure that they had coverage on where they needed it and if they had, you know, too shaky a camera or, or whatever. But you know, a very unusual experience with making the bay too. Usually, you know, you buddy up with the cameraman, you know, so he'll be your friend, but it's kind of hard to buddy up with so many people. You learn your lines, but then Barry might decide that, he, oh, I don't like this line. You know, say this. And, he'll, and you were rewriting as you were going along. So it was like, wow, I'm so sorry, I memorized all those lines. <laughs> and I just made something up, which is kind of what we did. The happiest part of the day was when he came and he said at the end of my scene, and he said, um, well, we liked you, and we want to write you into another scene later on that takes place on the bridge. And so it's, yeah! <laughs> That's great. And I heard they did that to about 20 other people. <laughs> they really liked being here. There was one of the, the young woman, girl who's in it um, with the cell phone. They just loved her. You'll see quite a lot of her in the film and a lot of local people. And don't forget that Bill Ogers is doing a show called Weird Tales. It's next Saturday at 4 o'clock and 7 o'clock. And you can call the box office, 527-2924, for reservations. We all know Bill Overson. It's going to be a great show because he shows all the circuits. All right, enjoy the show. How many of you were in the film that are sitting? And how many of you know somebody in the film that's sitting? Okay. If you see your granddaughter, daughter, husband, wife, or whatever, please don't say, that's my husband, that's my granddaughter, that's my husband. Many times when these films happen and people say, well, that's him, that's him, that's him, and then we lose some of the script. But you can nudge, nudge the person next to you and let them know, but I think you're going to recognize a lot of folks here in Georgetown and uh, a lot of great scenery. So sit back, enjoy the movie, have fun with it. <laughs> Thank you.